got that far before I hit it. Whew. So we got the, the some feeder posts in there, and and now for the GMC commercial, you know, for an old used truck. <laughs> I actually would have laughed if he had to reload all that. He was just complaining that his back was bothering him. Yeah. Yeah. So got this trimmed down a little bit so that my bolts are long enough now. Anyway, we'll continue and we'll check back in later. pushes it, there'll be a little ramp here, a triangle with a flat piece, so it'll push up and kind of sit on that. So it won't really be hanging on there, but as it's swinging, it will be. So it's important to brace it. So I've got that down in the hole. I'll get it lined up and I'll put concrete here and there, and then we'll be able to so the hang it off. Cut this out. That's, was it four? Yes. Good. So I'm going to go a little lower. Right there. Nice. Up just a smidge, screw it, pour, and that'll be braced. See ya. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, that'll work. So I'll, I'll 
get that as deep as that'll go and I'm going to match it up to a hole right here. So, get the angle if I can. Right about there, what do you think, Mama? Mm -hmm. So it's not deep at all, but it's just enough that it'll lock in there. And then I notched this end so that it's not just going to be screws or nails holding it in place. Um, the screws and na nails will will um, keep it from, from moving, but the actual work's going to be done by, by the cedar or by whatever the heck this was that we recycled. So uh, I'm going to throw a couple screws in here and one up there. It'll be locked in. That'll be our diagonal brace on this side, and then we'll be ready to, to hang that gate. Okay. Here we go. How's that look? Does that look cool? Good? Yeah. So now that we've got it propped up there, take a look how we got it up there with the. Uh, Now what's cool about this gate, y'all, is a car can't get through, but here. But a wee person right under <laughs> maybe out today? No, I don't know. <laughs> Right in between the sizes that I have. See, that one's too big to get this daggone thread to bite. Daggone, daggone. Daggone, daggone. Feels a little better, let's see. When they say right tool for the job, I think I've definitely got the right tool for the job here. What do you think? Make sure you do righty tidy, lefty loosey. Yeah. Lucy and Lucy. Is, it, is that how Re, 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 Ricky Ricardo, yeah. right? Yeah. That was a good show. One with the chocolates. Everybody remembers one with the chocolates. Yeah, where they're stuffing it in their mouth yeah, on the conveyor belt. Lucy, you got a lot of explaining to do. Ah, I'm not very good at accents. We actually live in the state that couldn't decide which side it wanted to take in the Civil War. It's like, like we don't want to tick anybody off, we just won't take sides. What well, is it happening then? Everybody has their fighting take place there. And they get more messed up than just about anybody. All respect to Georgia with Sherman's March and all. I don't know which state got it the worst, but... I'd say those two are pretty bad. All right. What do you think? We ready to try to hang this part too? Right here? Ow. Maybe. You squat that long, your knees get mad at you. And I got mud shoes now. All right. Uh, hand off camera lady duties. He, she woman over there. She-ra, is that right? He-man and she-ra. I certainly am no He-Man. I'm gonna lift my side and set it right back down. Really? These pins will line up. I think I am. I might have to do some trimming to the bottom. You see it? Yeah, lady, come up. That doesn't account for that. But it's okay, I'll be able to back those screws out 
should give me more room. See how it's biting there? It's pinching. Yeah, the wood's right been up against the other wood. Yeah. All right, Mama, hold this. And I'll see if I can adjust those out without completely taking the thing down. You go ahead and pause it. Or stop it. All right, so where we got it binding here, that's an easy fix. If I can get my chainsaw in here somewhere. Let's go the other way. I'm going to pick up some more mud while I'm at it. You never have too much mud, right? I'm pinching a little bit. All right, try it. No, this way. We already know it can go that way. Bring it this way. Oh, keep coming. Keep, why don't you get on the other side and push? I got it. <laughs> you looking over there? Keep coming. Is it, is it biting again? Oh, you little. All right, let me get it some more. Where's my bolt here? Ooh, I don't want to get too close to that. <laughs> camera ladies one and three I think where is it binding I don't see it binding oh, down in the mud. oh down the bottom keep going oh yeah just mud caught in there oh the very very bottom it, the, the tree kind of kicks out right there close here um I, I like the way it's swinging open though but you see how much more of a gap there is here than there is down here right so what mm -hmm. I might need to do is just either back this one out a little ways or bring the top in a little it's better to bring the bottom out um, if you want to come around a little bit right here though you can see my bolts kind of short so if I want to you can see I already I already had to, to cut in a little bit I might have to cut a little more to let that stick out more. Or I can just trim this because it's getting close to being closed there. Open it just a wee bit. Oh, I guess that is opening, isn't it? Oh, that way a little bit. There you can stop. So, it's not done, but you can see the idea, the, the, the extra hardware to, to help it you know, sit on the post over there and over here. For now, we're just using a... I'm so proud of myself. This, is, this might be the most redneck thing. Look at that. Look how well balanced it is. It's barely moving at all. It might be the wind. Oh, it almost got you. Look at that. this out come on over come on around come on around so we had to do a little bit of custom fit here you'll note I used the chainsaw repeatedly to get it to fit just ever so right look at this when it's closed look look at the and fit you the see bug. that and then over here I actually I didn't want to pull the bolt all the way out but I had to recess that a little countersink that that bolt a little bit so what I did is I used a hole saw, offset this way and then this way, mm -hmm. and then I just chiseled that out so the washer fit in there. Anyways, so we've got braced, we've got it hung. I feel like it's a job well done for now. We will be back when I put the, the, the actuator on. So that's called the gate opener, the motorized gate opener. We'll come back once the, once all the hardware is on and, and that's on the way. 
Is this too redneck or is this just just the right amount? Look, it's even got it's even you know because you don't want to touch it here. It's got a handle. Look at that. Mm. And then look at this spot right here. What are you gonna, what are you gonna put here? I don't know, a wreath. Yes, you know you're gonna put a wreath on that. Mm -hmm. You Christmassy lady, you. All right, see ya. Should we leave it open? Sure. Be welcoming today? Yeah.